Hey TDC, what's going on? It's Creeper here, and for you guys today, I have some more Ghost Recon news and updates and sorts of stuff. So last week, guys, I talked about the uh, Ghost Recon new DLC pack that's coming out later in this month, and now we have gotten even more information about it, so uh, I'm going to talk about it again today. Hopefully next week I will be able to tell you a story or actually like look over the map pack with you guys. I'm not exactly sure when it's coming out. Uh, it, actually, I am exactly sure when it's coming out, but this is a whole, a whole video it's about. I'm not exactly sure if I can bring you gameplay, guys, because I might be away, so I won't be able to record gameplay for uh, the map pack. So I'll probably just have a story or something for you guys next week, and then the week after or so I will uh, get you some gameplay of the map pack. But we have some uh, new maps coming in. So there are uh, maps that are going to be able to play for uh, the, what's it called, the multiplayer. And they are pretty cool. There are one, there's like three of them, I think. And uh, they seem to all be in like a city kind of area. So some of them you seem like, it's like a hotel city area. One looks like, one's in this, looks like it's in the city. The other one looks like it's on a high rise kind of thing because it's called Skyline. So it's probably like a boat. It looks like a boat or a, uh, a skyscraper on top of it. And then one's Riot, which is like in the streets and, uh, the other ones, I can't really pronounce it, but it's also going to be sort of in the streets. Uh, but uh, Riot looks more like a run, more of a rundown place. And then uh, the Gorilla Mode map is Arctic Base, which looks real like you really can't see anything from a picture they give you. But it, it is looks sick, guys. It's going to be a snowy Gorilla map, and I, I hope it's uh, a good map, guys, because it can be really fun. And if you guys don't know, the whole week leading up to this map pack, there is double XP. So it started uh, Tuesday, the, uh, I can't remember. But, uh, yeah, it started Tuesday of whatever day it is. So, and the map pack, guys, is only going to be, what's it called? It's for Microsoft, it's only going to be 800. Hundred Microsoft points. So this is uh, a good thing, I guess, in a way, because it's not the regular twelve. Uh, it's not the regular like fifteen dollars. It's only ten dollars. But uh, I wish it was less, like five dollars or something. But it's not. So I actually don't know when the map pack is coming out. Uh, it, it says the Arctic Strike DLC will be available for download on June seventeenth for eight hundred. Uh, Microsoft points. So I don't know if that means PS3 isn't getting it and PC isn't getting it straight away. I don't know. I hope that wouldn't be the case because I know Call of Duty does that and I really hope this game would not follow that same path and uh, having Xbox pay them do that kind of stuff. But uh, oh well, whatever happens, happens. I'm on Xbox so personally it doesn't affect me at all. But uh, there's a new game mode that's going to be introduced, guys. I'm going to go over that really quickly. It's called Stockade. And they, uh, the description they gave is, uh, Stock is an exciting, fun, objective-based uh, game type where the situation can be turned around in seconds, which sounds, which sound, which makes it sound like a great game. Uh, this is it's more of a team deathmatch thing, which uh, I'm pretty sure they tried to bring something in like this because uh, people sort of want a team deathmatch. I'm not 100% sure, but they could have had it in one of the past games. I didn't play any of them, but this seems like it's going to be a really fun game type, guys. Uh, so when players die, they go into this spawn queue, which is, um, quote unquote, the stockade. That's why it's called stockade. And when a player gets killed, when a player gets a kill, one dead teammate gets freed from the stockade. So, uh, and, uh, completing objective frees all of their teammates from the stockade. So that means it's probably gonna be like conflict, but, uh, you get points for like shooting uh, you're killing enemies, or you get points for doing, or, or you get points for completing the objective, and then you just have less players if you don't have anyone out. So it seems like it's going to be some kind of conflict uh, type game mode. If you guys don't play Ghost Recon, you probably won't know what the game type. Uh, the game mode conflict is sort of just uh, a bunch of oh, it's what I'm playing right now. It's just a bunch of different objectives scattered across the map, like that appeared randomly. And uh, there's double XP, like I said, is going on right now. And Stock A, you'll be able to play through uh, 13 different multiplayer maps. And the overall objective in Stock A is simple. Eliminate the entire enemy team before time expires. And then the, uh, in the event of the... T oh, so I'm guessing you just have to uh, get rid of... Yeah, so never mind. You just have to get rid of all the enemy players because they'll all be stuck in the Stock A and no one can save each other. So... 
that sounds like it's going to be a lot of fun. So, uh, I also heard a rumor that they're going to, uh, currently the level cap's 50 for all the characters, and I heard they were going to bump it up to 60. So, that, that's, that seems pretty exciting. And they're bringing in some new weapons, too. Uh, I can't remember the name right now. I think they're bringing in the uh, P, PM9, the F2000. Uh, I can't remember all the guns' names off the top of my head, guys. But I've been able to remember all the rest of this stuff off the top of my head. But, uh, yeah, so but they're bringing some really good guns in. So, look forward to that, guys. If you guys don't have Ghost Recon... You'll be able to see all the gameplay here. I'll be trying to bring you every single gun, every single map, and uh, et cetera, et cetera. And so, thank you guys for watching. It's been Creeper, and if you guys want, would rather me just give you go... Uh, never mind, just forget what I said. Thank you guys for watching. It's been Creeper, and hopefully, guys, I will have a story for you next week or some uh, new map pack footage. Peace out.